If you've spent any time watching the news lately, you've probably seen stories talking about high interest rates for home mortgages and doom and gloom for the real estate industry. But don't worry, if you're in the Amelia Island and Fernandina Beach area, our real estate market is still strong. I'm Colleen Gerkes with Ingle and Volkler's Amelia Island, and I'm here to bring you your monthly real estate market update for our area. Just like the weather in our area, the real estate market is heating back up. The average sales price of a home in May 2023 was $614,262. This is down just 2% compared to a year ago. But stop and think about that for a minute. That price is over half a million dollars. It's a bit mind-boggling compared to the prices we were seeing pre-COVID. Single-family homes are selling faster now than they have been any other time in 2023. A year ago, homes were staying on the market an average of just seven days. Today, homes are staying on the market an average of 27 days. Well, this is a big jump from last year. It's less than half the time we were seeing earlier this year when homes were averaging 56 days on the market. Homes are closing much faster too. The medium time to sale in May 2023 was just 70 days. That's not too far off from the 56 days we were seeing this time last year, but it's a lot faster than the 169 days we saw in February. Housing supply is limited with fewer new listings coming on the market. The number of new homes listed for sale is down more than 35% compared to this time last year. There are currently just 2.6 months supply of inventory in our area. Since supply is limited, on average sellers are selling their home for 98% of their original list price. Despite the rising interest rates, the proportion of finance deals in the marketplace is about the same as it was a year ago. With the higher interest rates, I'm getting a lot of questions wondering if buyers are still taking out mortgages. Currently, 32% of the homes purchased in our area are paid in cash. This is down just slightly from the 35% of cash deals seen a year ago. Something you won't see in these stats, but what I'm seeing and experiencing with my boots on the ground working as a realtor are more multiple offers on properties as well as escalatory addendums are coming back. These were really common when the market was red hot in 2021 and the first half of 2022, but they hadn't been so popular in recent months. However, they seem to be back. That said, no one has a crystal ball for the real estate industry. However, we can take a closer look at your area and what prices in your neighborhood are doing or the neighborhood you're looking to move to. Feel free to reach out to me. I'm happy to sit down with you and walk through your situation so we can come up with a customized plan. And for more real estate information, feel free to visit my blog at closewithcolleen.com blog.